Well, there is nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crowd. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined, as always, on these big occasions by the former Arsenal and England defender, Lee Dixon. It's Barcelona facing Real Madrid. Well, I'm so excited for the players. We see them coming out there. Excited because of what they've got ahead of them. Are they nervous? Looking at them closely in the eyes. Nerves play a big part in games like this, Derek. I'm nervous for them. Who's going to be the hero? The Barcelona shape looks like this. It looks like 4-3-3, but without a true centre-forward. Yeah, three up front, but with a slightly withdrawn role for the central striker. A narrow midfield has a strong look about it, and a conventional back four completes the shape. And this is it. The final of the UEFA Champions League. It's where everyone wants to be. Only two sides can accomplish that feat. And Lee, it's going to be fascinating to see what happens tonight. Well, it is. It's the big part here. It will be after the game. But as players, it's very difficult to try and stay in the moment and not get carried away. And that's the job of the senior players in the dressing room, but also the coach. Look around your team, see the calm ones, have a word with them, get them to pass the message on, stick to the game plan, go out and win the game. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Marcelo starts with Sergio Ramos at the back. Cristiano Ronaldo starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And leading the line today is Karim Benzema. Lionel Messi. Now Griezmann. And the flag has gone up, offside. Karim Benzema. Di Maria now. Now, what does Di Maria have in store for the defenders? What a vital intervention. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we expect from him today, Lee? Well, when you're playing against a player, sometimes you're trying to look at what his qualities are. Is he a good hold-up player? Is he quick? Is he this? Is he that? But when somebody tells you he's a finisher, you know you're in big trouble. Di Maria. Modric waiting. Lionel Messi. Fruitful looking attack. And he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Cristiano Ronaldo. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Modric. Di Maria now. Modric. And a pretty straightforward stop for the goalkeeper there. Yeah, weak shot, straight at him, no problem for the goalie. Ronaldo, excellent defending. In with a chance. A goal for Barcelona. The Blaugrana out in front in the Champions League final. So how important will that be for Barcelona to get their noses in front? That remains to be seen.
Well, here's the replay. Super fast counter-attack football at its best. There's still a lot of work to be done, but the keeper presents the near post on a plate and he's punished. That's quite remarkable. Well, he's every right to be angry. The players are not executing his game plan today. So Real restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they find an equaliser? And the flag raised. Offside it is. Can they get in behind them? And he's in. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, this is worth another look, Derek. Lovely movement and guile to easily evade the defender. And once he gets himself settled with the keeper to beat, he hammers it into the back of the net. Smashing goal. So 2-0 now. from the best effort you'll see in this match. Well, let's hope he gets another chance because he wasted that one. Cristiano Ronaldo. Carvajal. Benzema. And finishing there with more of a whimper than a bang. Derek, that reminded me of you. Finishing like that, it's just terrible. I wouldn't have done that. He's in here. Well, he's missed it, and you have to be opportunistically when you're chasing a game. Two goals down, you've got to take chances like that, Derek. Keeper at fault. Di Maria. Could be. What a lovely strike. Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. Well, here's the replay. It's a really dangerous ball into the penalty area. And then he does well to read the flight of the ball, doesn't he? Just cushions it beyond the keeper in the end. And that seems to catch him off guard. Nice finish. On they go again. And I wonder, can Real push for a leveller here? Benzema. 
Well, attacking possibilities. Ronaldo. Terrific block there. Barca really haven't seen too much of the ball, but they won't mind. They're winning this game. And why? Because their counter-attack is absolutely fantastic. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. The corner courtesy of Lionel Messi. Well, it all counts for naught. Well, he could run onto it here. And he's broken free. Can he convert? And danger still. Well, threat over for now. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Messi. And Real with the ball again. Benzema. In behind for him to chase. He's just got to continue his run. And foiled by Jordi Alba. What a vital intervention. And there's the whistle. Half time it is. A radiant Champions League final up to this point, Lee. Well, nervous, cagey, boring. Not so this final. This has been a really entertaining game so far. Looking forward to more of the same in the second half, Derek. In with a chance. A goal for Barcelona, the Blaugrana out in front in the Champions League final. So how important will that be for Barcelona? Can they get in behind them? And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Far from the best effort you'll see in this match. Well, let's hope he gets another chance because he wasted that one. Well, he's missed it and you have to be opportunistically when you're chasing a game. Two goals down, you've got to take chances like that, Derek. Di Maria. Finishing, drilled home with true conviction. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Into the advanced position. Couldn't keep the ball. And that is offside. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Modric. Oh, in with a chance. 
Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. Fired over by Messi. Thumped clear. Barca maintain possession. Advantage. Has a go. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. with the corner not the result from the set piece they were looking for corner again and firing it into the area relatively straightforward to mop up defensively Oh, what an opportunity. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, he's gone for pure power. And why not when you've got a rocket in your boot? What a strike. Let's have another view of that goal. Well, they've been poor all day, Derek, and your sense is going to be a rollicking in that dressing room after the game. So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. It's a perfect challenge. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Well, not hard to read that pass. Ronaldo, and he's broken free. Can he finish? Well, he's missed it, and you have to be opportunistically when you're chasing a game. Two goals down. You've got to take chances like that, Derek. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Unable to keep the ball that time. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Can they take advantage of the situation? And there it is! Three goals in front now. An immense performance. Well, here's the replay. Super fast counter-attack football at its best. And then through on goal. Do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Well, he's turning into a real shocker. This is the very reason, Derek, I'm not a manager. So continuing with the game, and the fact of the matter is, Barca are handing out a very harsh lesson. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. Chance to 
to finish. And the keeper showing tremendous command. Corner kick played in. Well, punched clear. Sergio Ramos. Can he take the chance? Able to get his body in the way. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. <laughs> and taken short. And crossed in there. He's lost possession of the ball. Chance to cross. Well, good play to stop the ball going in. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Taking the corner, Di Maria. And the keeper deals with the danger. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. This looks promising. Well, I'm offside anyway, albeit a tight one. Jordi Alba and now Coutinho Messi really a very poor ball counter attacking very much an option Lucas Vasquez Flag up, tight offside. And given that we're in the second half and it has got a bit ugly from the scoreline point of view, what positives can you find, Lee? Well, I've never seen... And a long way out! The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. They've given him too much, and he's through here. Oh, what an opportunity! It's been squandered. Well, you dream of 1v1s as players. He's had one, and he's squandered it big time. Magnificent defending. Jordi Alba. Breaking at pace. Won it back. And now the wait is over. Barcelona have done it. The Champions League trophy will return to Catalonia. Well, magnificent end to a long, long, hard season. Eventually, they've got their rewards and fully, fully justified. Well, for one team, it's a story of celebration. For the other, bitter disappointment. But the Barca players will remember this night for the rest of their lives. And as a player, Lee, as a Barcelona player in this case, this 
is what you want to experience. Well, it is. You have expectations at the start of the season, all those long, hard training sessions in pre-season. You kind of need a goal to get through that pain. And focusing on winning trophies for Barcelona will be that carrot that they need. It's Barcelona's Champions League. And they've got to savour this. It's not every night this comes along. Well, it probably will be here next year, you never know. <laughs> the way they play, but fully deserved. And they'll have uh, celebrations right throughout the night with their families and friends. Well, this is the moment I love, sharing it with the fans. The ticker tape's coming down, the family's in the stand, giving them all a wave. Well, they've travelled all over Europe watching this team. Now they get to share in this moment. Fantastic. that took fire as well as ice on the pitch and now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken well you know exactly where I'd be sitting in that photo don't you Derek <laughs> I think I've heard it before Lee <laughs> straight at the front <laughs> chance a goal for Barcelona the Blaugrana out in front in the Champions League final so how important will that be for Bar can they get in behind them and a goal to increase the lead in this final will they Di Maria. Could be. What a lovely strike. Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Barca maintain possession. Advantage. Has a go. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. Oh, what an opportunity. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way. Can they take advantage of the situation? And there it is. Three goals in front now. And a minute. Commanding goalkeeping. Well, he's given a corner, they referee. 